Today on My Engineering Projects, I'll finish up my telescope by soldering up all the components and putting them in this handy little box so that I can take it anywhere. Okay, I've got this all soldered up and I have uh, four pins and a potentiometer. And then I ran out of room so I had to do a second board for some of the connections. My two drivers and my Arduino Nano. And so I've, I've made this box right here and I'm going to do a lid here in a few minutes. And then I have four mounting posts. So I'll put the cables through this slot. I'll put a lid on it to hold the switches. Okay, so the first thing I need to do is I just have a very simple slot and try to hold this connector in place. There should be enough room to get the ribbons out, so I'm going to disconnect my motor, the wires going to the motor for the time being. All right, now the first one, the first board goes down in here to carefully put these wires up onto these four posts right here. All right, now that the first box is installed, I'll go ahead and put the second ones in here and tuck my wires in real carefully. Okay, let's see if we have enough room to get this connection on. We do. Okay, oh, I, I didn't have a shorter bolt there, so I'm just going to have to use the longer one because that's all I could do. But that's nice and firm, and then I want to very carefully bend these leads down. And then we'll run the wires uh, through this slot right here, going to the motor. And they'll lay in like that. So, okay, so what I need to do next is put the lid on. And there should be enough room that it can either go here in this little slot where it won't. See, it has to be low enough that when we put it on there, we have room. It's pretty tight. But I like this big potentiometer better than those little ones for the development boards. Okay, the next step here is going to be to mount the ribbons going to the motors. Okay, and then very carefully route them right through this slot. Okay. Okay, so here's the top, and this is a little slot here for so I can see the LEDs. And here's the potentiometer, and the right and left, and the up and down, and then some mounting holes. So we'll go ahead and mount the potentiometer. And then I've got these labeled. turn on. So now we can hold it and I can move it around and then you can see the LEDs. So I got those set up so and then the next thing to do is just get a nice little battery pack so I don't have to have a have this power supply and I can take it anywhere. 